everybody. First stream of 2024. I just became very paranoid about my audio effects potentially not being on. Hold on. They're on. Yay. <laughs> okay, I just wanted to make sure. I just had a moment where I was like, maybe they're not on because uh, I hadn't checked today. Hello. Hi. How is everybody doing? I'm very excited to be back. I straight up have been waiting to do this stream series for like a month now at least. Um and man is it is it just so good to 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 be here. Um we have a lot of stuff to go over, which is why I'm bringing in vod heads and stream heads at the very beginning here cuz I have some announcements I have some context to give and it's been a little bit. So like we can just hang out for a second. Um, but don't worry. I won't hang out for too long because I am ravenous to play this game. Um, I've been waiting for so long. Uh, I'm very excited. Okay. So, um, announcements, the very, the very big announcement I was debating on whether I wanted to do a shadow drop at the end of the stream and then ha like announce it at the end, like kind of tease y'all like, oh, wait till the end of the stream for a special announcement. Um, but I decided it's not going to be a shadow drop. I'm just going to tell you. Brand new public Snapcube Discord server tomorrow. I will be posting the link in the current sub discord as well as maybe on tumblr maybe um what i would like to do is do a stream where i have the link available but starting tomorrow it's gonna it's gonna be open i'm gonna be sending the link out to places i might not like slap it on twitter because like you know because i'm i want to make things easy we only have about like seven core mods, not counting me and the other like server heads. Um, but like I straight up have been, oh man, literally for for like a week straight, uh, Sophie, Duke, and I have been working on putting this server together like almost nonstop. And then specifically for like the last two or three days, this shit has been like a full-time job for me, which is why I didn't stream last night, which is why I didn't stream the night before. I wanted to stream a lot earlier um but i was just too tired <laughs> i was just way i straight up let me tell you my day yesterday um i got four hours of sleep woke up at nine in the morning was out running errands until i want to say um like noon and then from that point I spent the rest of my day going over mod applications and like sending out uh, like acceptances and everything. And um, it was a lot. Sophie, Sophie Duke and I straight up like sat in a in a in a voice call for like four hours straight going over applications and we didn't even get through all of them. Actually, maybe that wasn't yesterday. I would not be surprised if it was if it wasn't yesterday because time is fake. But we have some good news. Not only is the new server launching tomorrow, but in the process of gathering mods for this Discord server, which we were not going to launch without a solid group of mods, we finally, after like half a year of me single-handedly modding the Twitch chat, we, we like actually have some people who are volunteering to moderate the Twitch chat on occasion. So brave for that. Replace brave with stupid and you maybe have like a more accurate uh, read on the situation. I should not have waited that long. Um, I'm surprised it didn't go a lot worse than it did. We actually kind of like did pretty well for ourselves considering how irresponsible that was. So yeah, we have some, we have some new Twitch mods. Um, it is purely, uh, so, so these are, so I'm going to be working on getting some new, like dedicated Twitch mods just to make sure that we like, if not always, maybe like 90% of the time have someone around that isn't just me. 
Um, but for now, what we have are uh, people who applied to be Discord mods and like graciously offer their time, purely optional to uh, help run things around here as well. Uh, so show them your appreciation. Uh, please show them your respect uh, because honest to God, we are all just trying to work together, make things safe and smooth. Um, but uh, yeah, uh, welcome. Welcome to the, to the new mods who are currently here. If you're a mod who's watching this later, welcome to you as well from the past. Make things easy for them. Yeah, please be familiar with the rules, follow them, all that good stuff. Um, okay, is there anything else in terms of like announcements? Let me see. Uh, I don't know. Um, this is, this is going to be the first stream series of 2024. We're going to play through Final Fantasy VII Remake. I have some other stream playthroughs in the backlog that I'm currently planning. Some with guests, some not. Um, but I'm just, I'm just happy to be back. I'm happy to settle in. I finally feel like I have a moment to breathe. <laughs> um, we're going to be, we're going to be launching the server tomorrow. So that's going to be a, like a little moment where I like things are going to kick up for me in terms of stress level. Um, in a fun way, in a fun way. Don't get me wrong. Um, what I would like to do is maybe do like a short stream tomorrow, launch the discord during the stream, have a command that people can direct to, uh, and join from there. And then after a very short stream, um, maybe we could do like an impromptu movie night. Cause, um, I want to do events in the new server. Um, it has been, it's been literally upwards of maybe like five plus years since I had a public Discord server. Um, I, there's a lot of new stuff, first of all. There's a lot of new features. Um, but secondly, it's just a different kind of landscape. And also, I feel more equipped to handle it. Um, I have a, like, like a very trustworthy support system. Um, Sophie and Duke, I have to, I have to keep, like, I feel obsessive about expressing just how much of a of a huge huge gigantic help they have been sophie and duke in the realm of like discord moderation community management and all that good stuff i legitimately do not know a single person who does it better than them honest to god they are so they're just such they're such good friends and such good people to work with um and honest to god none of this would have happened without them so uh, please, whenever you get the chance, if ever you get the chance, give them your appreciation as well. Um, don't spam them, but, you know, just if if it ever comes up, <laughs> uh, definitely just know that uh, they're they're like the backbone of this happening at all. Um, but yeah, it's been a while since I did something like that. I obviously I, I've had the the sub server for a little bit now, and that's been fun. It's been chill. No real problems have popped up that are are worth noting from that. Um, but the problem is that, you know, it being behind a paywall, it can get a little dead. And uh, I definitely found that it was kind of like a bit of a spiral where the more dead it got, the less I kind of felt uh, like inspired to do, like do anything there. And then, you know, the less I do stuff there, the more dead it gets and that kind of stuff. So um, honestly, I just kind of felt like it was time to create and kind of cultivate my own sort of community space. Um, I Discord for me is not like ideal, but at the same time, um, it's better than Twitter. <laughs> at, at, at present, I think at the very least, I could create a space on, uh, on, on a Snapcube server that is better than relying on Twitter for like uh, just general news and stuff. I wanted to... I really wanted to um, start working towards moving away from relying on Twitter for like announcements and and general like community info and stuff. Um, so I wanted to have a space where people could join and just kind of like get a feel for what's going on and maybe meet some like like minded people and just have a good time. Um, so yeah, new Discord tomorrow. I'm nervous, but I'm excited. And um, I also reserve the right, because this has happened before. We're, we're setting things up a lot better now. 
I have a I have a much better head on my shoulders than I used to back in the day. Um, I believe I, I give myself that credit. Um, but also on top of that, uh, we just kind of have a better foundation. So I think it's going to go better this time. Uh, but I but I have tried the public server thing back in like what, like 2018 or whatever. And um, it didn't go well. And I had to leave just for my own like mental health and just general just the vibes were off. So um, I reserve the right to do that again. I just want to say that up front. If this doesn't work, I can get rid of it. And you have to be okay with that. And that's fine. <laughs> and like we can we can get over it. Um, but I I think it's gonna go better. So we're trying it. Cause I think I think it could be nice. I think it'd be real I think it'd be really fun. Um, we got some nice places to uh we we got some nice forum channels where you can uh there's like a gallery channel where you can post fan art. Quite literally in like a gallery view like a like a media tab or like an instagram account where like it's just like it's you, you see the images down and you scroll through it's in like a big grid it's super cool love that we also have a forum channel for questions um as well as one for media discussion so um if you want to talk about video games or movies it all goes in the same channel you just make different threads for it um which is awesome. I love that feature. It's so cool. Uh, and then it is also customizable in terms of what notifications you get. So if you're worried about joining something like that and being like, well, I would like to join and see maybe when like new videos are posted, but I don't really watch streams. Um, or maybe you're a VOD head, but you're not a stream head. Or maybe you're a VOD head, but you don't care about the main channel. All of those notifications are customizable. So when you join you will get the option to uh choose whether you are a vod head a stream head and they are communicated in this way uh you choose whether you're a vod head a stream head or a snap cube normie or if you don't want any of those notifications whatsoever you are still required to get like huge big notifications because like you're there why would you be there if you didn't want to see anything um but you can turn off notifications for streams. You can turn off notifications for second channel videos, first channel videos, um, and you can pick multiple. So you don't have to pick just one. Um, you can also opt in or opt out of uh, community events. So if you don't, if you want to just get like stream notifications, but you don't want to like do movie nights or anything like that, you can turn that off too. Very customizable, very fun. I'm excited. Okay, I'm talking. Hold on, I'm talking too much. <laughs> One sec, I need a second. Okay. That's all I'll say about the server for now. Um, we've put a lot of work into it. I'm very excited about it. But that's for tomorrow. I can um I can do a quick a quick uh celebration stream. And then we can like watch a movie together. There's a stage channel. We could watch like, I don't know. Spider-Man? I genuinely haven't thought this through <laughs> whatsoever. We could do something. <laughs> I don't know. I wanted to, I, I want to do something to break it in. Uh, but I haven't really fully thought. Spike it's 3D. That would be fucked up. Discord doesn't come with 3D glasses. Can we watch Sam Raimi Spider-Man? That was actually the one I was thinking of. Yo! Yo, Jules Card with the Barbie movie drop. Uh, or sorry, Barbie movies specifically. And I know you're not talking about that Greta Gerwig joint. You're talking about, I know this, I can feel you're talking about like Princess and the Popper, Fairytopia, uh, Swan Lake, yeah. I'm talking about the fucking Nutcracker. You understand. This person gets it. Um, yeah. I don't know if that would be my, <laughs> all jokes aside. I don't think that would be my first choice for like general interest, but um, yeah. Okay. So give myself a moment to breathe. <sighs> like, like the, like imagine dragons <gasps> <sighs> or whatever they do. Um, okay. I'm going to calm down. Now let's talk about Final Fantasy. I'm going to get really excited again. <laughs> Just so you know, I'm about to start talking about Final Fantasy. So it's inevitable. I'm going to try, though. Um, okay. Tonight, 
first episode of Final Fantasy VII Remake. Some of you may be familiar, some of you may be not familiar. Um, some of you may be not too familiar. Whether or not it's a new craze is up to you. I'm not going to get on your case about that. Um, that was stupid. Okay, so, so, so <laughs> actually, some of you may remember that in 2020, when this game first came out, I actually did stream it on release. I played it. Um, I did three streams of varying lengths. I think I did like one hour long stream where we literally only played chapter one. Like like the the reactor section. Nightbot. Nightbot doesn't have a sub here. Let me fix that. Nightbot gets a sub for one year. So we don't have to do this again. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cool. Awesome. Um, and thank you to everyone else who's gifting subs, by the way. Uh, I appreciate it a ton. Okay. Um, so I played FF7 Remake on release 2020. I spent or I spent like an hour on the first stream. And then I think I did like three or four hours for stream two. The longest I ever spent in the game on stream. And then uh, I streamed it a third time and it was like another like hour, maybe two hours max. Um, and I liked the game, but I was very non-committal about streaming it. Um, and then what ended up happening is that I decided to can the stream series and I just played it. Um, I was not as accustomed to doing longer games as I am now comparatively. I still have trouble, but you know, we do better now. Um, so I just dropped it and I played through it on my own time, but I never finished it. So if your question is, Penny, is this your first time playing FF7 Remake? Um, no, but also I still have not seen all of it. I've played maybe two thirds of it. There is going, we are going to pass a threshold where I have not played and I am seeing things completely fresh before we get to the end. Um, and on top of that, I, one, did not play it even super thoroughly. There was a lot of, like, bonus content that I just skipped over. So I could do some of that, and that would be fresh. And also, secondly, it's been four years. <laughs> like, it's been er, at least nearly four years. Um, which means that I have forgotten so much. But I will say, in the last, like, month or so of... um waiting to stream this game i have been ravenously slowly inching through the opening chapters trying to sate my insane hunger to play this without doing a full playthrough off stream so that i could keep myself at least somewhat fresh but at this point <laughs> i am very familiar with the first maybe like three or four chapters maybe three i would say um so, yeah, uh, but I have been just incredible. Oh, also, more added context in case you're not familiar and you haven't been, like, if you didn't watch the Crisis Core stream. Um, the first time I played this game, I had never played original FF7. So I had no context of the original story. FF7 Remake was the first FF7 related thing I ever played, ever. I didn't, I never watched Advent Children. I had never played Kingdom Hearts. Um, this was the first introduction to FF7 for me. Um, all things considered, really, really not a bad start. This game is incredible, and it really understands the characters in a way that made me realize just how kind of good these characters are. Um, so the reason I have been so crazy to play this is because recently, like uh, within the past couple months, I actually did end up finally playing through the original game. So I now have all the context of OG FF7. So now I can replay this, not only with the new context from the original game, but also I can finish it. And that's what we're doing. And then I'm going to play Rebirth when that comes out. Have you seen Advent Children? I actually literally just watched Advent Children like two nights ago. 
uh, with Mar and Joy. Uh, we had been we had been wanting to watch it for like weeks. Uh, we kept trying to plan it, but it kept not working out. But we finally got to watch it. We watched Advent Children complete. And I didn't like it. <laughs> it wasn't very, it wasn't very good. Um, I I kind of I didn't really like it. I was going to say I didn't like it at all. Um, that's not true. There is a long stretch of time where they are doing nothing but jumping at each other and fighting and yelling and running all over the place and driving on motorcycles and flipping around. That is some of the coolest shit I've ever seen in my life. Um, the the alley-oop scene where they fling Cloud up into the air in like a chain link with the entire party up that like scaffolding coolest thing i've ever seen i was popping off it was awesome but uh the movie itself the story is hot garbage imo um i was very disappointed learning that it was a sequel to ff7 it was a sequel to ff 7s story that instead of doing anything more interesting it kind of just elected to make up an excuse for him to fight Sephiroth again. <laughs> like, like I, I, cause I knew it was a sequel, but I didn't really know. I didn't really know what was up with it. Um, and so I was kind of expecting like anything at all to progress, but I'm not kidding. Um, by the end of that movie, I'm like, what even effectively what like are their circumstances really any different in like a meaningful way um and i i straight up couldn't tell you maybe i need to watch it again and here's the thing if we can manage to get tickets i am gonna watch it again when it comes back to theaters in february despite not liking it we are planning to see it in theaters <laughs> which is definitely the way i should be spending my time um but yeah um it's it it kind of like it it, it is my favorite interpretation of the characters, and also I didn't like the story, but the third act was sick as hell and worth the watch, specifically for uh, the action choreography. Absolutely. Tiva's outfit does slay. We were, we were going crazy over... I mean, I'm always going crazy over Tiva, but um, that whole, like, long tail in the back, shorts in the front look, oh, mwah. Perfect. Fantastic. Uh, but yeah, so I think it might be time to go. It might, it might be time to do it. It's almost nine. We got to get going. I can't promise. Uh, I can't promise a super long stream tonight. I will say, uh, just in particular, um, I'm so tired. <laughs> I really am exhausted. We've been working. We've been working so hard on the server, and genuinely, I mean, like it has felt like a full time job uh, for the past couple of days. Um, and I'm happy to do it because it's been extremely fun. And I, like, I don't mean to complain. I just mean to like explain why it's exhausting. But like, it also has been extremely fun. So um, I'm very happy to be working on it. But also, now that it's almost done, I'm like, I I just need to rest. So I'm gonna go as long as I can tonight. But at the very least, um, I'm excited for y'all to be here, and I hope you enjoy Final Fantasy VII Remake. Uh, let's get into it. That's right, if you haven't been on the stream recently, also. Uh, shit's full screen now. Oh, there's that prelude. Okay, yeah, so you'll see that I have, I have save files already. Oh, by the way, just in case you also were curious, we are gonna play intermission, but of course after. So that is on the docket, just so you know. Okay, uh, let's get going. Gonna do default and normal classic, or normal difficulty, not classic. Let's go. Oh, I'm so ready. I kind of just, I want to soak this in. This, I'm going to be honest. Um, 
by the end of this playthrough, this might be one of my favorite games of all time. <laughs> like, like, truly honest to God. Not to, like, give it way too high expectations, but just based off of what I remember from what I've already played and how I feel about it now after playing OG FF7, this, this might be up there. This game is sticky. This game is sticky in my mind. It, um, it has lingered for years. And now that I can appreciate it further, that might bump it up to, like, favorite of all time material. It's also actually insane that this cutscene looks better than Advent Children. <laughs> like... Oh, time. Time is an ever flying arrow. How's, how's the audio levels, by the way? Can you all hear everything? Oh, here we go. I have zero nostalgia for this game. This music make me want it makes me want to cry. <laughs> What was that? I know, she's so gorgeous. Oh my god. All the women in this game. Just you wait. Are you an Aerith truther? I can, I can get into that later. Ask me, ask me again later. Short answer is if if the implication of what you're if, if I'm correct about the implication of what you're asking, no. And I have my reasons why. And then we sweep in. There's my guy. Oh. If 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 some of you have never seen anything related to FF7, you're in for a treat. I'll tell you that much. The characters in this game are so just vivid. Oh man, VOD heads are not gonna get that, unfortunately. I'm uploading that one unlisted, because it's it's just gonna go unfinished. Jesse! There he is. Oh. Hi Barrett. Get down here, Merc. Get down here, Merc. There he is. Let's go!
this <laughs> he's he's the prettiest person probably in the entire world <laughs> look at this i am i am i am fully a lesbian but this this man approaches like leon kennedy levels of like i gotta hand it to him this time <laughs> like i don't know what they did they put some sauce in the uh, in this in this character design let me tell you anyway hello all right oh i've i've Who literally seen this opening like i said i've you seen this opening like in the double digits of times at this point but i'm just extremely hype about it right now just because like we're in it now like i'm finally here and i'm sharing it with people and that like really heightens it for me okay battle basics Use square to attack with cloud sword. Hold hold square to unleash an attack capable of hitting multiple nearby enemies. You're coming with us. Nice and easy. Don't so, so this game is a very cool combat system. It is sort of a a, a marriage of um real time combat with some like command based systems and like spell casting and stuff reminiscent of classic RPG style. That's where I can see him. Similar to Kingdom Hearts, if you're more familiar with that, but um, it's got its own flavor to it. Have fun. I fucking love Jesse. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> okay. Uh, the ATB gauge fills as time passes, and by attacking the square, once a bar is full, you can, your character can perform special actions. Charges can be used immediately or saved. Try attacking the enemy to fill the gauge. Freeze. You got it. Move and we shoot. Go ahead. Okay. You can expend ATV charges to perform battle commands, such as using abilities, magic, or items. Uh, press X and try using one of the commands. So, when you open up the menu, everything just, like, freezes. It, like, slows to a crawl to the point of being near frozen. So, you can do an ability, like, for example, Braver. There you go. Let's go. This game loves particle effects. Well... So do I. So we we have that in common. <laughs> uh, okay, main menu and map. All this is, I don't need to read that. It's it's a main menu, it's a map. Uh, that is just telling you how to interact with context things. Okay. So when you see arrows, you just walk up. Drop the weapon. You got this. Yeah, what he said. Oh, yeah, by the way, if you recognize that voice, but you can't quite place it, that is, in fact, Badger from uh, Breaking Bad, <laughs> who's who is playing Wedge. Um, incredible casting decision. Literally the perfect choice. I don't know. I don't know who. I don't know what genius elected to go that route, but they were. They had a vision. They had a vision from God <laughs> for that one, I think. The casting in this game is really good. OK, uh, R1 to guard, circle to evade. A successful guard reduces the amount of damage suffered and also charges your HP. You're coming you with it. us. Can't get surrounded. No. That it? How much have I missed? We literally just started. You're good. It's like the first room. Okay. Uh, triangle to open stuff. He's a just sassy little scamp. Yeah, his one-liners are... Um, his his one-liners are... A, another comparison to Leon. They are very Leon Kennedy tier uh, in terms of just how delightful they are. Why does Cloud talk so much? What, you don't like it? What's wrong with you? <laughs> I do not understand. You don't want to hear what he has to say? He's a special boy. He's very brave. Um, okay. So boxes with Shinra logo, you destroy them for items. Whoop. And if you don't know what the Shinra logo is, that's okay. I'll take care of that. I'm the streamer. You don't have to worry about that. That's why, that's why you're watching. It's easy. We we have a we have a symbiotic relationship in this way. So what's Hi, the boy's deal? Is he one of us now? He's got balls. This uh, uh, what was his name again? Cloud. Cloud Strife. Right. And he isn't a soldier anymore. 
Still, he's a professional, unlike the rest of us. I'm glad to have him. <laughs> His name's Clue. This is a one-time gig. When it's done, we're done. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I love that the, the, uh, the very, uh, the extremely specific and common, like, vocal grunts and everything. I genuinely love it. I'm not even being facetious. Um, uh, uh. also, I don't, I don't know why I just now noticed this. A very, I don't know, I'm, I'm just like, note, I'm noting the, the choice of spelling one-time gig when combining one time into a single word. Is that, is that common? Is that proper? I assume, because it's there, but I don't think I've ever, I don't think I've ever at least noted that. Also, yeah, Jesse is played by Erica Lindbeck, who Come is on, fantastic. Nobody do something this crazy just for money. They may not think you're a true believer, but you know what I think? Not interested. I'm oh. not an Aerith truther. What the fuck does that mean? You're weird. Which? Uh, <sighs> you Hi. better be worth the money, Merc. <gasps> Every last gill. Are you mad at me? <laughs> they have they have banter. It's okay. They'll learn to get along. We'll be a found family. We can do that. Yes! Oh, this shot. This is this is like full on fan service. I love that. That that shot was a very look at the 3D graphics kind of shot in the PlayStation 1 version. Um, so, you know, you gotta throw it in there. Uh, lock on. Yep, pretty simple. Guess you're first. That's that. Hey! Looks like you're next. Nice. <laughs> Nothing this game still doesn't feel real to me sometimes. I love that. It is, it's just like extremely, it's... It's special. Um, nope, wrong one, on. There we go. Okay, so what you can do is rather than going into, you, you may have seen me doing it a couple things already, uh, a couple times already. Uh, instead of like going into the full like slow down battle menu, you can, um, how do you do this actually? Should be battle settings, right? Yes, oh, it was literally right there. <laughs> clicked into it um you can set up like quick actions essentially uh so for i'm gonna keep this on braver this can be focus thrust still um and then i want to put i want to put a spell on l1x so let's do fire you can kh shortcut yeah oh man you know i'm i'm not gonna, <laughs> I, was gonna ask, I was gonna talk about how much i want to play kingdom hearts 2 again not not play Kingdom Hearts 2 again, because I've never played it. I I meant I was about to talk about it again. I can't wait. <laughs> Can you? I was gonna I was gonna say might might be closer than you think. I don't know. We'll see. I know I, I literally keep saying that. There, you have like literally no reason to trust me. But um I'll say, you know. We'll, yeah, we'll see. We'll see. I don't, yeah. <laughs> it's just hard, okay. Huh? Not so fast. We've got company. It's not company, that's a dog. <laughs> I'm sorry. This will be quick. Oh man, the jokes are not the jokes are not happening tonight. This is a this is a penny gushes about beautiful women video game. This is not a I'm the funniest streamer on the face of the planet video game. I just want to set that expectation up front. Uh, quick, make this, make this funny. Uh, edit him to have a 
funny part he had on his head. <laughs> yeah, we did it. That's that. Let's go. Chad, did you like it? He already has one. No, that's a it's a party helmet. The funny part is that she would be putting a party hat on top of his party helmet. And you would you would have no reason to wear both. Why would you wear both? See? We can we can do we can do stuff. It's okay. Oh, let's uh fire. Calling fire. He's dead in one shot. Dead. He's so weak. He's not even fireproof. Much like the uh, he's not even fireproof like the Venom suit from Marvel Spider-Man 2 on the PlayStation 5 is, but not like the Venom suit from every other piece of media featuring the Venom suit is. Yeah, not all of them. Ow, it's hot. Oh, sh oh shit, it's hot. Oh, fuck. Why did they... Why did they put this right in front of the, the steam... Fuck. Okay. <laughs> Are you trying to impress chat? What, with my Spider-Man knowledge? No. I already impressed chat by having the best Spider-Man 2 playthrough on YouTube, okay? And I'm and I'm willing to say that. I'm willing to say that. Mine was the best one. I've watched other ones. They were pretty good. <laughs> but like, you know. I don't I don't have anything to prove. I'll secure our escape route, okay? I can't hear you, my guy. Keep them safe, please. The the only flaw this game has is that the audio mixing can sometimes be just like a little a little rough. Don't worry about me. Go. Don't worry about hearing me. Just read the subtitles. Oh, one thing I actually really wanted to change. Um I Gonna put camera distance out of battle to two. Two, two. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, in battle to three. Soldiers may attack on command, but I hear they make good guard dogs too. Bet you've seen a few reactors. So how do we get to the bridge above Mako's storage? The retranslation is so good. Ain't it's like he's he's me, saying the you? same stuff, but he's actually like Stamp scared to bite the hand that fed him. Communicating or is he right a loyal things. little dog. <laughs> oh shit, that was mud. We can do this with you, or we can do this without you. That little bit of static was layout. Cloud Depends finding that kind of hot and not really knowing how to Never process. seen one like this, but I'll manage. Oh fuck. How do I do what do I do with that? What do I do with that info? I'm watching you. <laughs> Hi Jesse. Don't you worry. Biggs will have the door open soon. Don't you worry. Biggs will have the door open soon. I just wanna I just wanna hear her talk. Don't you worry. Biggs will have the door open soon. Chat, you don't mind this, right? You're you're on the same you're on the same page as me. You kinda just wanna Don't you worry. Biggs will have the door open soon. I just like, I like hearing her tell me not to worry. Don't you worry. Biggs will have the door open soon. Don't worry, buddy. <laughs> like, like, you just press the button. Don't worry, buddy. The fuck? In three, That's from Sonic Adventure 2. Damn, I'm good. <laughs> Who's there? Door! That's not a door. <laughs> it's Cloud Strife from Final Fantasy. That's, that's the second time I've made that's that genre of joke. I'm rusty. Oh shit, I missed a really good e Okay, so he says, oh man. He says that's my line and it's really funny and I was I was yapping over it, I'm sorry. <laughs> Switching modes. Everyone has a unique ability. Yeah, run it back. It's it's like the clue situation. We gotta reload the game. Um. Uh, yeah, so basically uh, triangle activates Punisher mode. He's a He's a oh, fuck is he doing? 
In Punisher mode, Cloud moves more slowly, but Square unleashes a more powerful attack than usual. Uh, in addition, Cloud launches a counter blow every time he guards against an enemy's melee attack, so it comes with a free parry. Um, he cannot, however, guard against rage attacks or magic. Uh, but if you evade, we can take it. he'll switch back take to Operator. I love Punisher mode. He's very good. Oop. I will say, you you will notice, I'm not super good at dodging. Or, I'm not super good at blocking. I'm also not super good at dodging, but we'll get there. We'll get there. Then let's move. He always knows just what to say. <laughs> he is a he is a charmer. That's famous famous cloud personality trait is that he is extremely personable. Simmer down, hot shot. It's a good thing I know someone who can get us the passcodes. <sighs> Pity no one else at command will talk to us, but what can you do? <sighs> then we're good. Careful in there. <laughs> Some weird ghosting there. Oh, oh where? Well, now you got me curious. Wait, don't talk about the weird ghosting in this game. That's spoilers. <laughs> Kitty. The railing? Let's see what you mean. Oh, yeah! Oh, I have seen this. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know exactly. Yeah. Well, that is weird. For? Okay. Security is only going to get tighter, so be ready. We can't afford any more mistakes. Oh. Is this a mistake? Not really. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. Looks like the elevator's on another floor. Mind pushing that button? You got it. I'll do anything. If it makes you like me more. So, you know Tifa, right? It's not really my business, but are you guys close? Oh, oh boy, do we know Tifa. I forgot, I straight up forgot that they just show Nibelheim. Like right here. <laughs> it's genuinely so cool. Cloud. Hi Tifa! Oh, baby are Tifa. You me? How cute. Uh, yeah, got a problem. Tifa and I. Um, Cloud, it's Tifa and me. <laughs> I got, I got someone. I got. So I just, I just, I just saw. It. No, it's not. I'm sorry. These sewer rats appear to call themselves Avalanche, sir. We are currently investigating whether they belong to the same group that made the attempt on your life. Rest assured, our inquiries will not take much longer. <laughs> yeah, fuck these guys. This pump's sole purpose is to drain the planet dry. While you sleep, while you eat, while you shit, it's here <laughs> sucking up Mako. It doesn't rest and it doesn't care. You do realize what Mako is, don't you? Mako is the lifeblood of our world. He doesn't give a the shit. The planet bleeds green like you and me bleed red. The hell you think's gonna happen when it's all gone, huh? Answer me. He's right. You gonna stand He's got a point. There and pretend you can't hear the plant crying out in pain? I know you can! You really hear that? Damn straight I do! Get help. <laughs> <laughs> Say that again! Thought you're gonna die. He's lo he's gonna get himself killed. I worry less about the planet and more about the next five seconds. Save the screaming for later. One, two, three. Four, five. Okay, whew, we made it. 
Now can we worry about the planet? Our lives are on the line now. Me when I log on to <laughs> One false move. And that happens. Well, so much for having Cloud do all the fighting. There are some places a sword just can't reach. <laughs> okay, so... Just bear with him for me, would you? Oh, she was... Oh, damn. I missed the chance. <laughs> Should have asked for more money. <laughs> He's a silly guy. That's okay. He doesn't mean it. He's just grumpy. Um, we're about to introduce something cool. Come on. Yay! Okay, so this is the party system where you get to control your party members in battle um, in real time, which is super fun. Uh, Barrett specializes in ranged attacks. Holding down square releases a sustained burst of automatic fire when equipped with a ranged weapon. Barrett can fire from safe locations and hit enemies that Cloud cannot reach with a sword. sword. So now we are just playing as Barrett. These ten cans ain't got Extremely cool. Um, what abilities does he have? Let's see. Oh, he's got focus shot, which is good. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, sorry. Press uh, triangle while in control of Barrett to deliver a heavy hitting attack that fills a large portion of his uh, ATV gauge. Once unleashed, it takes a long time to recharge his attack. Pressing triangle, however, will speed up the process, which looks a little something like this. So you overcharge, does this big thing, and then if you want to... What the fuck? Did it miss? Well, if you want to charge it back up, you can uh, press triangle repeatedly and he does this little animation, which is awesome. I really that fucked it? that up, huh? Anyway. Fire in See ya. Okay. Then we can do overcharge on this guy. Which should take him out. And then we uh, switch back to Cloud. You got this. Do your to take out the little guys. Shut up. Very dynamic, very fun. <laughs> Um, you can also just play Cloud for the entire game and, you know, let them handle things with AI, but I, I will say I've noticed the AI is not the absolute best. Um, it's, it's not as aggressive as I want, I would say. Okay, let me just make sure I'm not missing anything. You could, but you probably shouldn't. Yeah. That's, that's basically how it goes. I, I guess it depends on what difficult, difficulty you're playing. Oh man, I have been, I've been using so many words. <laughs> my, my brain is tired. Okay, I um, hmm. I'm gonna wait to do anything too crazy with like equipment. Cause I do have, I do have some DLC stuff that I could apply if the spirit takes me. However, I will at the very least, just um, add some stuff to this thing. Oh, he has cure. Oh, that's awesome. We need that. Let's replace potion then with uh, thunder. Very cool. Uh, you can also set them as leader if you want to start the battle. How does this game compare to 14? Uh, it doesn't. <laughs> it's a com it is a completely, literally in every facet, it's a completely different game. There's no comparison. The laser security system. Great. Those things will hurt more than your pride if you're careless. They'll cut you down to size. There, there's no constructive comparison. Like, you wouldn't be doing any good trying to hit them up against each other. They can, they can coexist. Exactly. I'll go first. Nothing like a little danger to get the blood pumping. Hey! Just keep those baby blues of yours on me. Vinny, hi! Thank you so much! Uh, oh my god, thank you for the for the gifted subs. I really appreciate that. Hello, hello. Um Okay, so this is just teaching how to dash. Okay. Let me through. Whee! <laughs> He's so cute! Ah! 
<laughs> oh my god. Ow! Oh, she cares. Thank you, Jesse. Thank you. I do like how they, they do have Badger on the team and there is a character named Jesse. I am playing on PS5. Um, and you may have noticed that I'm specifically playing the quality mode because, um, though there is a performance mode, I think when uh, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth comes out, I really want to play on the 4K quality mode. Uh, and I don't want to spoil myself by playing the PC version where I can run it at 4K and 60 frames per second, though I have it, though I have it, um, because then playing Rebirth and having to bump back down to 30 FPS to get the resolution that I want is going to be a real bummer. So I'm just getting myself used to it now. And it's fine. It's honestly fine. I, I don't have a problem with it, so. Part of the appeal for me of this game is seeing like the, the visual spectacle of recontextualizing the, uh, the OG game in full fidelity. So like, I really, I really want that. Also, to be honest, I've been just a little, I've been a little 4K pilled recently. I'm very spoiled and um, it's becoming a problem when playing games on console. <laughs> those things sweepers for nothing they can wipe out a whole squad in seconds not if you wipe it forward then first so true ah, we can uh either for uh thank you uh for the so much for the sub sorry i literally didn't pronounce your name but thank you is that right we need to hit it with magic that should get magic got it bird bird Okay, <laughs> hitting enemies with certain attacks or dealing incenses, dude, in the freeze frame is just like, my biscuits are burning. Hitting enemies with certain attacks or dealing large amounts of damage will temporarily knock them off balance and pressured will appear underneath their gauge. Uh, when this happens, pelt them with spells and abilities to quickly fill their stagger gauge under the life bar. Once it is full, you can stagger them. Okay, so you focus on, you focus on Okay, I actually didn't pay enough attention to this tutorial the last time I like really read it because I would always just keep spamming attack when I saw um, pressure. No, you do abilities and magic to really make the most of pressure. Got it. The gauge shows faster depending on the abilities and magic used as well as the foe's vulnerabilities. Understood. So if we do another, we hit again and do another fire. There we go. Yeah. Oh, that'll do it. Let me give a command to Barrett to send thunder on this guy. Of course. He just had to get back up. So we oh, it damn it. Again. I missed no it. Uh, Alex PC Dev, thank you so much for the five gifted subs, by the way. I very much appreciate it. Sorry. Enemies who have been staggered are defenseless and take more damage. I love the, the crunchy text in the center of the screen. Using unique abilities on a staggered foe will quickly boost your ATV gauge. Boost your ATV gauge so you can unleash more abilities and spells. Got it? Yeah. Oh, awesome. The stagger is what really makes this game's combat shine. Yeah, I can. Oh. I sorry, I love this conversation. I really, yeah, I really want to get the hang of it because I will say I'm, I'm not. I'm not fully in tune with the with the rhythm of this game's combat. You might see it in the next boss fight. Uh, which I am infamously in my own brain not super good at. Uh, so bear with me. But um, I do want I really want to figure it out. Anyway, this conversation is really cute. He asks him, what are you like 20 something? First. Huh? Soldier first class. Doesn't go into the 20s. What the hell are you talking about? I mean your age, not your goddamn rank. I, uh... <clears throat> Though for all I know, a soldier's rank could be the same as his age. Get your emotes ready. Mm-hmm. Guess that make you a one-year-old, huh? Live and learn. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We actually, I'm actually realizing now we have multiple emotes that could, uh, cause I was thinking baby mode. I was thinking baby mode, but now people are posting one, which also kind of works. I didn't even think of that. I don't know about live and learn though. <laughs> like, well, like, why did he say live and learn? <laughs> Is it because, uh, 
Is is he rubbing it in Cloud's face that he didn't answer his question thoroughly enough? Live and learn, because now I'm calling you a baby. Haha. -ha. Oh, because babies are stupid. That's right. <laughs> That's right, yeah, I remember. The reactor core. Gotta set the bomb at the bottom. <laughs> I guess that make you a one-year-old, huh? Escape from the city. I guess that make you a one-year-old, huh? Fist bump. God damn. I can practically taste tobacco in here. Hurry it up. Babies literally know nothing. It's so funny how dumb they are. Honest to God. They like think they know things, but they don't. I've been dreaming about this for years. Heads up, boys. The end's in sight. They they can't even count to the numbers that I can count to easily. It's insane. Hi, Jesse. You're choosing me over the reactor? That's sweet, but I'll wait my turn. Go blow her mind. I have the biggest smile on my face. <laughs> Down the ladder, dummy. I just wanted you to be mean to me. What? Uh, what? All right. Let's go. Baby Geniuses is not a documentary. Yeah, more people need common misconception. No match Those babies are not geniuses. <laughs> That is actually a, <laughs> it's a harmful stereotype that does not reflect reality. <laughs> That's so stupid. That's <laughs> you think if we fell in, we sink right down to the bottom, to the planet's core? No, the pump would suck us back up. <laughs> How comforting. Oh shit, wait! Is that... Is that funny? Is that like a funny wink wink nod nod foreshadowing thing? Cause that like totally... That like comes into play, right? No. Oh, that's so funny. Wait, I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. I think I noted that at some point. I think it is. I, like, maybe, maybe in Crisis Core it came up? I don't know, I feel like I, I remember it coming up somewhere. I don't know, maybe I'm crazy. Oh yeah, Barrett singing the victory theme is so cute. I totally missed that. I was reading a chat message that was making me lose my mind, but I, I lost it, so I'm not gonna read it. <laughs> All right, let's see if little Stamp really can bite the hand that feeds. Go on, do the honors. Prove to me you're the man Tifa says you are. That you're one of us. Never said I was. I'm just here for the <laughs> paycheck. <you. laughs> then do the damn job! Then do the damn job! <sighs> He's so dramatic. <laughs> he's like making sure he knows he's not gonna like it. <laughs> Who's that? Who's that? What's wrong? <clears throat> I'm fine. What about the timer? You're calm, Merc. I'm gonna be so brave. I'm gonna be so brave and set it to 20 minutes. Pretty cocky, ain't you? Uh, no, Barrett. Brave. Huh? You dumb 
Double crossing. Oh, here we go. What do you think he... Oh, yeah, sorry. I forgot. Cloud summons the spider. The hey, All right, let's go. How the hell do we fight this Whoop. thing? It's got reinforced armor plating, but the internals can be overloaded. Lightning magic. Huh. No Lightning magic, so we got a... a charge? The hell is this? A target lock. Look out. Look out? Does that mean... <clears throat> Okay, that seems more like a block situation. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm not. I'm really not good at this fight. I do have to hit it with thunder. Then. Hell yeah! You see the damage that did? Keep it up. An enemy is about to use an attack that cannot be guarded against. The warning symbol will appear. Take evasive action when that mark displays next to an opponent's skill name. Okay, so just dodge. Okay. Fill up that ATV. Then um, I might actually, since we're about to fill up another bar, I might take this turn to cure Cloud. And then take Cloud for a second and hit it with magic. Then hit it with Thunder again, hopefully. Okay. We gonna let this thing keep pushing us around. I don't think so. So far, so good. I I will say I get really tripped up by even using items being tied to the ATV. I kind of I kind of just wish you could use items whenever, but I understand why. They're, everything is tied to the ATB that isn't like full on attacks. Okay, I'm gonna block. If we don't change it up soon, this thing's gonna kill us both. I understand. More shooting. How about less miss from you? Oh please! Oh no! <laughs> he got me in a corner. Um. Some enemies will occasionally bind your party members with unblockable attacks if your character is bound. Yeah, okay, so just Get switch to cloud. <laughs> Don't just stand here. Help me out, damn it. Oh, he's got a weak spot open. Okay. Let's do focus thrust on that. Please. Oh, shit. Okay. Barrett, I need you to cure one more time. Cure cloud. I just want to be... Damn really, it. really sure. Whoa. Uh oh. Okay, we're still locked. Mark 99 launchers. Yes, very good. Okay, we did it. Let's find that weak spot again. Oh, EM field. I I get so when I was playing this off stream, I got so constantly got by that move. No! Oh my god! Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Oh, shit. Okay, that's fine. Oh, you're in for it now. Just shoot. He does not, Barrett does not have any MP, so that's a problem. So we'll just do steel skin. Oh, shit. Yeah, see, that that happens when I'm controlling Cloud because it feels like... Oh man, oh man, I'm I'm floundering, I'm losing it. I'm gonna use a potion on myself. And Barrett can use overcharge. And then I really wish we had Oh you know what? He's an ether. Duh. But not put all the barriers. Then a second. Thunder please. Oh shit, it's immune! Oh, I should have done the generator! Oh man. Okay. This this fight is tough. Literally, for the first time in the game, it really It is a skill check. Is he gonna do EMF kill? Oh shit. Okay. The generator, thunder. Come on! Oh wait, is he is it is it just that Yeah, we gotta do something about the barrier. Okay, so even hitting the field generator with thunder is not going to do it. Got it. So instead, we will do focus shot. Go. 
And then let me get Cloud in there. Second. Back up. Oh, we didn't get hit by a single one. Oh, well. <laughs> Too soon. No! Oh, man. Here, get over here. Please, please, please. That was critical, but not quite. Oh, he's. Oh, he doesn't have the thing on now. Uh. Oh, shit. No, not. Oh, well. That's fine, I guess. Let's do overcharge, and then hopefully we can get enough to do thunder. Is he still immune? I don't. Oh, he does have. He does. It's just a different color now. I feel insane. Is. Wait, is that. Oh, no. Uh oh. It literally just said, bitch, heal. Please. Yeah, I'll do that. Let's use a potion on Cloud, who Still desperately it. needs it. Oh, pressured. Uh. Fire. Nope. This is so silly. Come on. Please. Damn it. Need to heal up soon. Oh, okay. Um Baron has a few slots here. Not good. Let's get fire on the sentinel. Oh holy shit. Oh my god. That would have maybe, that would have maybe done us in if Barret had not just made it with the heal. It says asshole while shooting at the scorpion. Asshole. All right, Barret, please, please help, Cloud. Yeah, no, this is this is tough. I feel like I've I feel like I've done this quicker. I'm I'm being more cautious, which is maybe not. Uh, it wouldn't be much yeah. of a weapon if it went down easy. Don't compliment the giant scorpion. Here it comes. Come on. No! Making <laughs> damage and staggering enemies fills your limit gauge! Yes! Oh my god. Okay. With the gauge well, you can use limit breaks, which are extremely powerful attacks. You do not need to spend ATB charges to use. Okay, first first limit break. No more playing nice. Let's see if we can do something about this. Please. Come on. Uh on the field generator. Come on, dude. I maybe should have just done that on the scorpion. That's fine. You do not, in fact, have to hand it to the scorpion. Barret is almost dead. Uh oh. Oh, this is like a full cutscene, though, which is good. We're making progress. Watch the tail. I'm just glad we're not doing this eight times to see if the game crashes. So what do we do? Don't Again, another Take cover another reference that vodheads will not understand. I apologize. Ooh, shit. Oh, I should have gone. Oh, oh, we have time. Quick. Behind the rubble. Please. Use a potion while we have the chance on Barret, and then one on myself. Now, before it fires again. Deal with that. Yeah. Let me, uh... Fire and you got this. Hang back. 
I was trying to take advantage of pressure. Gotta memorize the attack. This game crashing earlier? No, the the doing this eight times thing is a reference to. So, I'll, I'll give a little explanation to botheads. Um, in December, I started an on-stream playthrough of uh, the New Threat 2.0 mod for the original Final Fantasy. Ooh, that was bad. The original Final Fantasy VII. Um, because what I wanted to try to do was fit in a... He's about to get shot. Oh, no. <laughs> what I wanted to do was try to fit in a playthrough of, of the Midgar section of that game um, before starting my playthrough of Remake in January. However, um, I did not have the time. I got really busy uh, and it just didn't work out. So there's just kind of like an incomplete first part um, on the Twitch channel that I will upload as a VOD, but only unlisted, because I'm just going to shell the idea entirely for now. Um, it might come back after we're done playing Remake or after we're done playing uh, Rebirth. Uh, I don't know exactly, but for now, I'm just focusing on... Oh boy. Oh boy. Can you call it Clue's Curse? What, you mean like the video title? Not or just really. like colloquially? So far. Bird. Bird. Incoming. Take cover. There's really no other option. Want to get shot? Be my guest. It's on you. Yeah, Whoa, he just like teleported. Strike now. Okay. Before it fires again. Come on. Dude. Thunder? Weakness? Holy shit! Oh my god, this is so much. Hey, it's doing that thing again! Find cover and hunker down. Again and again and again. But you and you run out of cover for the laser? They fall down every time. Uh, you, you may have noticed just then they... They, like, fall from the sky every time he's about to do the attack, so... It is not impossible. There we go. Oh, we're getting so close. Cloud needs to come in with something. Here. Okay, fire is not doing a whole lot. Yeah, Braver does more than... There we go! There we go! Okay. We're in the final stretch. Okay, you get its legs? Take it out quickly, we're oh shit! Okay. So, get its legs and try not to get hit with EMF fields. Come on. Here we go. Okay. Oh, I meant to do braver. There we go. There we go. This will do it. This will do it. Oh, I, I was hoping that would be the final blow. That's okay. Come on. There we go. Oh, man. Oh, we got a raid. Oh, my God. Hi. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. We got a raid from Mar. Hi, Mar. I love you, Chirithi. I don't know what that means. Hi, Mar. Welcome in. We just beat the first tutorial boss for Final Fantasy VII Remake. Come on in. Feel free to join us. We're happy to have you. We're having a great time. Things are crazy, but we're still very early in the game, so don't don't be too intimidated. The game of all time. I know. 
I'm so happy. I'm so happy to be playing this. Uh, you hear that? Damn thing showed you how it's done. Come on, we've got to move. We didn't die. Where's All right, now we get 20 now? minutes. Go, go, go. Which is pretty much. That's kind of all we need. This game is like gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh, you know it. It is incredibly beautiful. Moogle Metal! Here, I'm gonna take a second to use another potion. Wait, can I? Oh, I can just do it in the. Actually, I'm. You... Whatever. It doesn't matter. Let's go. We gotta get out of here. Give me a break. I'm running, I'm running. Actually, I should take him out, because I probably won't be able to climb that ladder. Okay. Not bad. What was Mara up to? Oh, yeah, yeah, so uh, I actually know this. Uh, Mara was watching the Kingdom Hearts Union Cross cutscenes which is a defunct Kingdom Hearts mobile game that is completely necessary if you want to understand all of the lore of Kingdom Hearts. It is like story important. Help a girl out, would you? My hero. Hey, we'll link up over there. Look after Jesse. Come this way. You got it, Jesse. Hold on, there's boxes. They have writing on them. That makes me think I should break them. Sorry, my brain's a little fucked up and weird like that. I hope it's not too off-putting. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I might get a Moogle medal. Shut up and climb. You're not helping. Don't tell her to Sorry. shut up. It keeps me focused. I'll freak out if I don't talk. Have it your way. That's that's literally me on stream. I've I've said before how I get like extremely anxious if there's even like like 30 seconds of dead air without me saying anything. <laughs> Which is why my commentary Man, style is I'll throwing spaghetti at the wall. As much as it is. Don't worry, I'll be fine. I've got soldier boy with me. Yeah. X soldier boy. Oh, take them down. We don't have time for this shit. The clock ticking. Cool it. I love how much they cuss. That's that. No escape. I didn't need to use fire there. He would have died in a couple hits, but. Penny, is there also a reactor exploding around you? I mean, in the modern day 2024, it's, it sure as hell feels like it. Like, when is there not? Yeah. Woo! That was clean. No time to celebrate. Oh, sorry. Sorry. I didn't mean to celebrate on stream. It's fine. No fun allowed. Yeah. Cloud would not be a good streamer. <laughs> There's no time to celebrate. There's a hype train. 
Get your subs out now, then we'll deal with it after. What would he play? He would, uh, he would play around too much. <laughs> no, he would play like um, Sudoku, almost exclusively. Oh, okay, these shock troopers, I like don't fully know how to deal with them because they dodge a lot of hits, but maybe it's just, maybe the easiest way is just kind of to spam it, but maybe there's like a more effective way I could find out. We'll see. Let me, uh, we have time to do a quick ocean jet. You're on your own. Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, okay, so locking them in Punisher mode is really effective. So you get that, you get that free parry in. There we go, that'll do it. Oh, that's awesome. See, see, I, I, I said as much, I... I haven't ever really taken into account the parry as much as I should. I need to start though. Can you not stand underneath the the shot blocking stone or steel? How's the stream handling those shots from the security Sorry. camera? Like the super grainy overlay? Is it bitrate hell? Looks fine. Cool. Just curious. Oh, no! <laughs> So serene. <laughs> he's he's accepting. He said, "This is gonna go how it's gonna go." I'm fine with that. Bro's taking a nap. My guy is snoozing. Oh. One thing I love about how they do Jesse in this game is that she is she is horny for Cloud in a way that is extremely hilarious. Okay, that was pretty cool. All right, come on. Yeah, good for her, honestly. She deserves it. Let's go. Oh my god. like we made it and with nothing but a few scratches to show <laughs> think you might have overdone it i followed the instructions to the letter maybe it triggered a reaction with the mako she li she literally looked up on Unless like she literally looked up how to make case. a bomb on google <laughs> but the planet's what matters right <laughs> i mean this must have helped some 
After all that, it had better have. Anyway, let's get going. We in Sector 8? That'd be just down there. All right then, lead the way. You got it! Huh. I think Watch everything went really well. They're everywhere. Also, thankfully, um, uh, thankfully it didn't crash here again, Ugh. which is great. The air in here reeks. Can't wait to get out in the open. Man, what is that? I've never smelled anything so foul. Oh, it's me. Gotta do something about <laughs> that. And soon. He's smelling. Pulls up the Final Fantasy XIV screenshot of you telling Alpha No to take a bath, Stinky. I felt that one in my guts. They just keep on coming. We need to get out of this place. Was it the Mako density? The primary explosive? The blasting agent? Hey, we can figure that out later. Uh, I'm running on empty. The agent here. blasting? You can refuel at the base. Next time, I'll have to bring a little pick-me-up. You gonna keep a granola bar in your pocket on the... How much farther do we have to go? Not far. <laughs> On the explode the huge reactor mission? Okay. I'm not saying you can't. I'm just confirming for intel That's purposes. That's about as good a place as any. Stand back, then. I'll set the bomb. Guys, hold on. Wait. See you, Marlene. Can't wait I want to see the explosion. Shower. She's good to right. go. Everyone stand back. Fire in the hole! <laughs> oh, oh, wait, this is where OG FF7 kept crashing. You sure in New Threat. Let that be a lesson that gets in Either way, we made it. Attention, all citizens. Attention, all citizens. This is an alert from the Shinra Emergency Operations Center. Unidentified Very bold to trust this bomb after the last one, yeah. <laughs> it's okay, the first the first one was WikiHow. This one was a YouTube tutorial. A disaster warning has been issued in sectors one. She she actually watched someone build it, so it's it's a lot more reliable. Oh no. This couldn't have been us, could it? What are you talking what about? Was, what do you mean, what if? Done done? Merc's right. You've you've exploded two bombs of varying size tonight. This was just the first reactor. And the planet won't be safe till we get the rest. Yeah. We always knew this was gonna get messy. And this is only the beginning. Y'all gotta look at the bigger picture here. Nothing worth fighting for was ever won without sacrifice. Though you may not be crying out, I know you're in pain, just like the planet. But it's okay, cause I'm here for you, to help take the load off your shoulders. <laughs> your fears, your worries, your concerns, and yes, your feelings. My money. Whatever your problem, I got you. Huh. Hmm. So, what's our next move, boss? That's easy enough. We get our asses home. Hmm. <sighs> Is this implied to be the only city on the planet? No, no, no. Um. No, the, 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 the original game has a huge world map full of various cities and all kinds of stuff, which you will see more of. Uh, so this game, this game only takes place in Midgar, which is maybe the opening, like, we'll split up and shoot for the last three to four home. hours of FF7, depending on your pace. Got it. Um, uh, Rebirth. So, so, so you're basically, you're only going to see Midgar in this one. We will see more cities 
and the entire uh, world map. Hey. Not the entire world map, but a lot of the world map like my money now. in uh, Rebirth, which comes out in February, and that I will be covering. Base. And is a is is an open world game <laughs> as opposed to this game's linear linear RPG. Um, it's extremely cool. I'm excited about it. I don't need to tell you what this is, right? Of course not. It's healing material. You can have it for saving my life. Oh, thank Just you. Just doing my job. Nothing more. Yeah, yeah. Fact is, I'm lucky you were there. <laughs> Survival can be a matter of luck or skill. And you can't rely on luck. I love that line. <laughs> uh, yeah, well, thanks. Yeah, well, thanks. <laughs> you do know how to use it, right? You do know what I was, right? All right, uh, so... You can now set material to your weapons and armor. Try setting the healing material to your buster sword. Um, I'm not gonna go through the whole, the whole tutorial for this. I, I know how to use it, uh, and I'm sure y'all will pick up as we go. And if not, that's okay. That's why you're watching and not playing. Again, I I, I call back to the the relationship we talked about earlier. <laughs> Skipping it. Um, yeah. So let's put a uh, healing material on his sword. Um. I also, once we get out of this cutscene, I'm gonna adjust volume levels in game. Okay. Cause they they are too quiet. To oh, before I forget, here's a little something extra for being so brave. That really was the ride of a lifetime. Well, see you on the train. Yay! Okay, so we got we got extra potions and stuff for picking the 20 minute option, which is fun. Um. Okay. Let's do audio settings. Uh, let's turn the music as much as I hate as much as I hate to let's put music down SFX down but quieter than music than music oh god sorry <clears throat> and then I can bump the overall volume level to hopefully bring the voices up a little bit that should be good all right I'm just knocking over someone's bike. I don't care about bikes. I only care about Final Fantasy. Woo time engine! I got money. He just stole fifty bucks from a from a crate in the middle of the the middle of the road. That's fine. I do that sometimes, but don't tell. Cloud, I'm here. It's okay. Look up. You're safe now. I said look Not up! With Careful Hi. Here. This could collapse at any moment. If you want up, you'll have to we'll use those to stairs. Hang in now. These stairs? The ones I was walking towards already? No fucking way. They better make this right. Can you hear me? Where's that stretcher? Where are you? If you really want to get to the station, you can always climb those Keep stairs. Try These the stairs? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? What the hell? Is that allowed? Three grenades just sitting on top of a roof. Chat, where do you keep your grenades? Do you know proper grenade storage etiquette, or do you keep them on the roof? <laughs> Those are mine. Ha! Ah, well, not anymore. Finders keepers, baby! Uh, Intact. Nice try, officer. <laughs> what the? Well, that fire is pixelated. Oh no. Huh? Huh? What's going on? Oh, man! 
Oh, what a good shot. Oh, here it is. The shot I love seeing seven million times. A normal encounter. How? He couldn't be. But then. Oh, and then we go very, very slow. Oh. Uh. Oh wait, is this a? Uh... Is this a Nibelheim building? Oh my God, are they like a? I like mashing the two locales together in this in this scene. Was that or was that just in the city? That yeah, that's yeah. totally Nebel. That's so cool! Oh my god, I never noticed that. There, oh, it's like it, like it, he's combining them in his brain. Oh, that's awesome. The trauma, the trauma of it all. Oh boy. Oh, oh, we're staggering. Where is he? Oh. Almost there. You're not real. You're dead. I am. Um... <laughs> I killed you with my own. <gasps> oh, you need not remind me. It was the crowning moment of our time together. But that was then, and this is now. I have a favor to ask. Our beloved planet is dying. Slowly. Silently. Painfully. Oh, the Can sweat! Oh my god. To see the planet suffer. Cloud. For the planet to die, so many things will be lost. Your hometown, Earth, so bright. The sound of her voice, pleading for me to spare you. The Dude. shiver of her flesh, yielding to cold steel. The hedgehog. That which binds us together would be no more. And I would be loath to live in such a world, which is why I must ask you this one favor. Don't worry, it's a simple thing. Run, Cloud. Run away. You have to leave. You have to live. <gasps> you bastard! <laughs> Die now! Oh man. Good. Crazy. Very good. Hold on to that hatred. So that sequence is just entirely new. That is like not to my to my memory. That is just not in the actually. Actually, we just played it, so I would I would remember. Yeah, this is just not in the original. That's so cool. I'm seeing things. Fumes from all the Mako, maybe. All right, you got this. I don't know. I feel like uh, <laughs> an unprecedented hallucination that vivid and extended and long. Uh, I don't know, man. You might want to. I mean, it's not like you, you you know what's up, but you maybe want to keep that keep that thread open a little bit. Put a pin in it. Put a pin in it. The whole sector's in ruins. I'm At least you're dressed well. Things. <gasps> the same. Huh. Sephiroth. 
the same guy with the same clothes. I must be the Shit. Must be the it must be the Mako. We have to believe in Shinra. They'll they'll make it all better. Whoa, weird, weird. Whoa, that was weird. Hello? Do you have any meatloaf? Fuck. I'm so hungry. Hello? Bucket. He's on that Jimmy McGill shit. Kicking over trash cans. Man, what a mess. Yeah, someone should clean it up. Who's got the biggest broom? <laughs> I'm taking the kids to safety. No, we stay together. Yeah, together. Me when I'm, I'm jump scared by the voice of the teacher from Persona 5. Which happens a lot in this game. Oh, chat. Chat, we're about to meet someone very special. <laughs> I am so, I just remembered where we are. The mayor can kiss his job goodbye. The fires catch I'd like to stay here <gasps> if I can. Spotted. Hold on, though. Oh, not quite. <gasps> the material. Bastards who did we'll have to come back. They better catch the bastards who did this. Oh, she's so cute. I love... Uh oh. Uh oh. Cloud, step in. What happened to chivalry? Uh oh. Uh oh. It's not done. It's the Mako. You are too weak to save anyone. Not even yourself. That's mean. Are you okay? The specific timing of him saying that is extremely hey, mean. Are you okay? Hi! I'm fine. Here, this is for you. Yes. <laughs> a flower? That's right. It's a gift. You know, for scaring those things away. What things? Oh, man. Never mind. Think of it as a memento. Just my luck. <laughs> I heard that, you know. Flower. How much? Oh, the music! Oh my god! Stop! I'll cry! Well, I'll cry right that now. Depends on the customer. In your case, <laughs> it's on the house. Aww. Lovers used to give these when they were reunited. Look, I'm involved in things. Dangerous things. Oh, I'm sure you are. So? <laughs> so keep your distance. Wait, you think someone's out to get you? Is that what you're all worked up about? Relax. No one's going to attack you. I promise. Well... Hey, a Mako reactor just blew. You shouldn't be out here trying to self... <laughs> Yeah, about that. <laughs> this, this broad is weird. <laughs> uh oh. I'm so. I'm so curious about what's up with these guys now after playing OG. Because, like I said, I've played this before, but I never finished what it. Are they? Um, I have literally no context as to what is up with this shit. Drop your weapon! Are you blind? <laughs> this guy's no. weird, right, Cloud? <laughs> oh boy. Wait! 
Nice meeting you. Oh. <laughs> okay. Um. So. Personally. Right now. Of the. Of the whole lineup of just like wonderful, incredible uh, women in this video game, <laughs> uh, my favorite is Tiva, specifically after playing OG FF7. However, I will say this game, FF7 Remake specifically, does Aerith so well. She was my favorite for a very long time. Um, but then I played the full Nothing original game, it. and given the context of everything, after getting the full story, I am I am fully ride or die with Tifa. Um, it's Stop! extremely important to me that uh, that I see how they handle that whole aspect of the original game. She is she is such a strong character, and she is such a strong um, party member with Cloud. I, I genuinely. Oh my Let's God. go. I get so emotional about it, but I won't say anymore because I, I want to keep this relatively spoiler-free. Though I have the context now, um, for those who have it, uh, or for those who haven't, I would like to keep it pretty light on spoilers and illusions and stuff. Oh yeah, what is so? What material we just got? What is that? Oh, we so we can up. We can apply an accessory if we want. Um, what do we... Wait, can we? Oh, we don't have accessories. We have... The... Whoa. Huh? Whoa, this is weird. I'm supposed to have, like, DLC and stuff. Strange. Um, hey, honestly. Whatever. Uh, healing materia. Yeah, HP of materia. Let's replace, um, let's replace healing with HP up for now, because we have plenty of potions. You have to grab the DLC stuff from the pause menu. Oh, good point. Oh, there we go. Do I want any of these? Mako crystal. That's an accessory. Some of these might be a little overpowered, maybe. Um, I'll pick up. I'll, I'll pick up one summon. I think. Run hither and thither. I mean, I guess we don't have to equip any of these, but I. Yeah, I'll just. I'll. I'll hold on to them, but we will. We'll grab the. We'll grab the chocobo chick. Okay. Uh, summoning materia grants you the ability to call a powerful ally to your party's aid. A single summoning materia can be set to a weapon's materia slot. When facing a formidable enemy in battle, the entity slumbering within a set summoning materia may begin to stir, and the summoning gauge will appear. Carbuncle, and this is a little freak. I think I've seen how Car Carbuncle looks in this one, and I am not accustomed to it. They look, they look incorrect to me. Potion, how's it that going, Potion? Have gotten far. Stay alert. Don't want to stick around here. <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> like, come on, man. Don't want to stick around here. I sure hope nobody notices me standing here. There he is. You're not going anywhere. No holding back. This is sector eight unit so four. We have eyes on the ground. We need backup. Uh -huh. We need eight four requesting See you want backup. Bird. Bird. Not bad. Bird. Deadly dodge materia. Okay, I need this one. I love this one. Oh, what's this? Oh, this is the summon. Oh! Oh, there's a dedicated summoning slot. I see. That's really good, actually. Um, I'm gonna wait to equip it. We're still pretty early. I'll wait until we get to uh, Seventh Heaven. And then I'll go a little crazy with it. I'll have fun. Um, 
Oh, you know what? I might actually replace HP up with Deadly Dodge. For now. Because because Deadly Dodge just essentially makes it to where you can um, attack directly out of a dodge, which is really fun. It's very good. All clear. Show me your hands! Okay, I'll show you these hands if you can catch them. Try me. Shit. I'm like not doing good. Whoop. I see. Going in. Calling fire. Okay. You're better than this. You're better than this? The dog's cloud? <laughs> You should have been watching your six, or maybe your eight. Power race guards, here we go. Yes. Uh, I love how, by the way, I love how he has the little flowers still attached. Okay, cool. We finally have something. Race guards capable of drawing out power latent in the wearer's body. It has no material slots. Fuck. Shit. It's okay. I hope he has to have flower for the rest of the game. That would be cool. But there is a better way. And you'll Just see. Give it up. Don't run. Sick him. <laughs> Lock him in. Lock him in. There's nowhere to run. You're mine. Here we go. Oh my god. Poor fella. Target sighted. I repeat. Target Bird. Sniped. <laughs> Bird. 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 Oh, I should have used health. <laughs> Use a use a high potion. We got plenty. They don't get Thanos. It's Mako. Have you not been paying attention? Can you not hear the planet crying out in pain? Any time now. Let's finish this. Can y'all like, can y'all like, we quit. Don't let him escape! Oh shit. Give up! Enemy combatants, you are surrounded! Lay down your weapon and surrender! Move in! Move in! Engaging target and pocket plaza! All nearby units can burn and provide immediate support! Oh my god, that he just did a huge jump! Shit. 12 meters across, he teleported. That was not on target, my friend. You gotta pick your words more carefully, otherwise you might look like an idiot. But the rooftops look clear. Hello. I want to actually see. I feel like I miss this every time I play. Is this Don't a rest spot? Away, no matter what. No, it's just the models of her. No. Ah! Call. 
Be advised! Target approaching residential area! You all active immediately! Target sighted! Get him! It's all or nothing now. It's Saul or nothing. Was that ever a tagline on a Better Call Saul poster? Because if not, uh, missed opportunity. Wait, wait, hold on. Isn't that literally the name of the finale of the show? Wait. No, it's not. Wait. It's not Saul or nothing. It's, a. Uh, isn't it Saul done? It's Saul done. That's it. That's the name of the... In the last episode. It's all gone! Oh my god, I'm so silly. Yes, it's all gone, which is extremely funny. In a way that does not match the actual vibes of that episode. Here we go. Oh my god, the immediate! The one shot! Is that it? No way. It's Saul over. Okay. Saul over what, Rice? I see him! Enough. Not bad. Where are you? Oh. Enough. <laughs> Bird. Bird. It's never in doubt. Sorry, I. That's like a. That's approaching like vocal tick levels for me when I hear that. I can't. I can't not hear him just saying bird. It's really funny to me. I think I think it was the same because isn't it the same in Kingdom Hearts that they they shout burn when you use that? And I feel like I was making the same joke constantly. Why am I going this way? Come on! I got it. Oh man, that dodge attack is so good. Not bad. I know Sora loves to shout fire. Yeah, maybe, maybe not Kingdom Hearts. I think I am just thinking of the last time I played this, and I possibly did that when I last streamed this. The the bird thing. Bird. Boil. I do remember boil. Boil. He's here. Get ready. There we go. Oh man. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get a feel for it. I think. To do my own horn, but. Here we go. Gotcha. Enough. Oop. Okay, missed that one. That's okay. Let's do this. I see you. Come and get it. All right. Shit. Yeah, I missed that. Shit. <laughs> oh my god! He exploded into the telephone pole. That's awesome. Yeah! Oh, throw clamp is not good. So, let's do this. Now you're in for it. Know your limits. I'm definitely not using my abilities enough. I, I apologize, but sometimes you just like hitting that button, you know. Getting so many Moogle medals, though. So you gotta give me that. I'm getting everything. <laughs> this is this is not gonna be a 100% playthrough. I imagine not even approaching it, but I I am gonna be thorough. 
I keep I keep really wanting it to go into the uh But that doesn't that doesn't come up yet. Oh shit. Oh, oh hold on. Not quite the part I thought it was. Get ready. It's over. You can't see us. Any time it's over. I see. Oh shit. Oh, I'm doing bad. Ah, ah, ah. Hi, potion. Right. Hello, potion. Hello, potion. <laughs> is what my voice just said. I apologize. Ooh. Let's do um. Focus thrust on like everyone. That was not good. That did not work at all. That's that. Try this. No escape. So long. That's it. Shit, I missed pressure on that. No holding back. Oh, oh, the oh, there it is. There's a me. Oh, I just noticed it's doing the music bit. Oh yes. I, I looked over. I was I was so I was so tuned into what's going on. I look over and I see chat just just dancing, just partying. Come on. Come on, man. Here. Uh, maybe fire. Time to burn. Yeah. There we go. Brace yourself. Nice. Move in. Don't let him escape. HQ, this is Sector Eight, Unit Two. Target is surrounded. Moving to secure. Wait. I know that. Oh. Go, go, go! He's so cool. The second train. Oh, man. Okay. Kiss Cloud won't be joining us after all. No need to assume the worst. I'm sure he's fine. You saw him in action, didn't you? Guy's a soldier. Goddamn one-man army. You think he's a keeper? Impressive entrance. What a uh, cool yeah, guy. Worry for a minute. Huh? Huh? Uh, <laughs> what the hell you been up to? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Giving public security the runaround. That's what. Had to draw them away from the station somehow. Nicely done. Well, can't argue with results, huh? <clears throat> what? <sighs> Aww. He means well. Wait. Got a My question money. for you all. What? Ever been attacked by an invisible enemy? Uh, what? Wearing robes. Came and went like the wind. <laughs> Thought they were invisible. Like Mickey they Mouse? Were, at first. Only saw them after she grabbed me. A new Shinra weapon, maybe? <laughs> More like a panic induced hallucination. <clears throat> Yeah, that's what I was Never like. mind. Forget I said anything. Suit yourself. Come on, let's move up. Do you guys believe in ghosts? Is, is the, the conversation they just had. A lot of people here. And in the freight Oh, too. man. Because of the evacuation order, maybe? Lucky this us. We've got a crowd to hide here. Head for the front of the train and hold there. 
due to an explosion at Mako Reactor One. An emergency schedule. We get we get a little breather. Actually, we this, this upcoming stretch of like maybe thirty to forty minutes is a is a whole breather. We are we are past the like bombastic intro of the game. We got some time to chill. Oh, just taking man. the character, which is nice. Wow, and it's like there'll be people right in the freight car. I guess they don't have much choice, but rather than Hey Wedge, how are you doing? Stop that right right now. Please should have gone to sector three instead. Man, everyone's on edge. Of course they are. Hey, Cloud. I am... I'm on Wedge. If you're about to unburden yourself, don't. Yeesh. You don't make it easy. No thieves get my money. <laughs> we were out on a date when it happened. Yeah, he doesn't. He's he's working on it. It's okay. Hey, got a sec? You're uh, holding up pretty well, huh? Even after what we saw at the station and all over Sector Eight, I'm a soldier. Well, wow. my hands are still shaking. Yet. You get used to it. Something to look forward to, or maybe <laughs> not. You see, my I, will, I, I really like Sector Eight. So. Hi, Jesse. Little help, Cloud. Please, don't be. Stupid. I can't stop thinking about yeah, it. The bomb I made shouldn't have too. produced an explosion that big. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor sure have fail-safes to prevent that kind of thing? No, mm -hmm. You probably exploded the fail-safe. invisible enemies back there, right? Right. Oh, no. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. <sighs> Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. Oh, I love you, time. What kind of maniacs would go so far as to bomb a reactor? She has my hair. What the fuck? Uh, Wait, what the fuck? That's my hair. It has almost the exact same color too. Huh. Luckily, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? That's not me, guys. That's not me. I'm not, I'm not a general employee. Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Hmm? Just, just who do you think you are? A law-abiding concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? Hmm. Uh, uh, shh. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A message to the bastards Yo, bleeding up. This rendition tribe. of this song in the background is actually they so got good. it. Heard it loud and clear. <laughs> Y'all's masters. <laughs> we will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work <laughs> together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized uh, people emoji. change the world. Oh my god. Uh, go back to Reddit. To... That is the Shinra Creed. Hmm. <laughs> the fucking clapping is so funny. That is the Shinra Creed. <laughs> fighting words. It's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? We should go. Right. <laughs> Saul Goodman moment. All right. You don't look tired. What? <laughs> you said you don't look tired. Oh, Stay dear. awake. Uh, oh, dear. I didn't hear anything. You gotta believe me. They'd probably kill us if they knew we were the ones responsible. No, don't think about it. They'd probably kill us if they knew we were the ones responsible. How'd you do that? <laughs> How'd you do that with your mouth? His mouth was closed. He, how do you fade yourself out like that? Well, I get it if you can't relate. Uh, shower might help. A long, hot one. <laughs> no, don't think about it. Says it again. <laughs> this, this dumbass. You hear that suit? Me when I'm not thinking about it. 
We're the good guys, damn it. You hear that suit? Shinra Creed, my ass. How does everyone do that? Everyone can do that except me. Hi, Jazzy. Who's it? Is that Germa? <laughs> okay, that's fine. Let's get this out of the way. Personally, I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. If it helps, think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not... There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. Shit, I missed it. God fucking so, damn it. Wait! How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not... There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. Here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar, complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level. Atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, I have nothing to explain. Yeah. Around this main pillar. You'll get it. Look, Chat supports me. We're about halfway through it now. They've set I'm just being honest. I'm just playing this how I would play. The IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history. All that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. <sighs> Don't worry. Our IDs are impeccable. What I tell you? Have a little faith. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there got to struggle to survive. That Shinra fucking sucks pizza. up Mako while the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know. Yeah, you yeah, stare those daggers into him. He's got a point, and you know it. I love Barrett. Oh my god, I literally I love Barrett so like much. This train, I suppose. There's only one way it can go. Yeah, he does. He has, he's, he has beautiful eyes too. I mean, everyone in this game does, but. Is worth noting. Sweetheart. Don't worry, I'm fine. Oh, you're oh, goodness. <laughs> I'm not your father. No way. But hello. <laughs> We are good! <laughs> Bombs detonated one, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! <laughs> Hell yeah, that was huh? so cute! People are listening. You're uh -huh. literally the one who said, uh -huh. hmm. now get oh, some damn, we are good. You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Barrett, you brought that energy in. You can't, I mean, they were just, they were just yes anding. That was on you. That's so funny. See you soon. Uh, at Seventh Heaven. You know, where Tifa works. <gasps> Don't keep her waiting. She worry. <laughs> Sorry. Tifa mention. I pogged in real life. Um, chat, you're about to meet someone very special. <laughs> Can you guess? <laughs> Is still there? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like crying. Train okay. Oh man. Puppy. And um, I'm I'm all out of the cold brew that I poured for this stream, and it is bothering me. No words can describe how what kind of the planes were. Are the the cavalry that shows around the wires all over the slums. Avalanche. 
Dumb place he's only had it so good because of the reaction. I've never seen anything like it before. Sonic? Yeah, well, shoes on the other foot now. Let's see how they like fighting to survive. They're people too, you know. Sounds intense. Oh. <laughs> I've never seen anything like it before. It was completely insane. Security was out in full force looking for the bombers. I even saw a few helicopters. Wow, that sounds huh? intense. Like a I'm not gonna I'm not gonna listen to every bit of flavor text in like a dedicated thing, but Hi, this guy. Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. Goddamn eco warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look <laughs> at all that steel work. You're trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> ah! What the? You okay, buddy? <sighs> Mako Junkie, huh? Figures. Uh-oh! Look out! The ghost! You again. The ghost. Okay. They're still here. Did you see those? No? Okay. Uh, I'm probably normal. Can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. When I get back, it's refueling time. And you, Jesse? <laughs> I don't know. Figure out how I screwed up. <laughs> oh, she's so You're such a kidder. She's not. She's guilt. She feels guilty. The the weight of her sins are weighing upon her. Oh, here we go. There it is. Seventh heaven. Have a great day. Spotted. Guys, I'm so nervous. Guys, how does my hair look? Does it... And no, don't say it looks like a Shinra employee. Do you think she'll like me? I don't know. Sorry, I'm just like, I'm getting like... What do you know? That ain't half bad. I'll make a gross monkey out of you yet. Thanks. I've always dreamed of opening up my own shop. She waves at you! Uh, this is my, like, fifth time playing this segment. That's okay. I'm normal, probably. Hello! Marlene! Marlene! Such a cutie! Daddy, you're home! That's right, Angel. I Welcome am. back. <laughs> Have you been a good girl? That's yes, so sweet. <laughs> oh, you did, did you? Well, well. <laughs> you made I've been it. helping Diva. <laughs> Where'd you get that? I can't remember the last time I saw a real one. <laughs> <gasps> Such a gentleman. <laughs> How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? I can so change. Cute. Has been five years. Huh? Huh? I oh, I love that. Right. Come on in. The kind of thing you just do not understand until, you know. Daddy, the Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV's talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? No TV. It's like, uh, what is it? Almost 11? Yeah, that's not a good time. Do you mind keeping Marlene company until I'm done with this? Me? Yeah, you. Yeah, sure, I'm great with kids. Uh, you got your COVID shot yet? Uh. <laughs> Anti-vaxxer. What the hell you think you're doing scaring my daughter like that? Barrett, your kid's a right-wing nut. <laughs> That's right, honey. I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering daddy's lessons. <laughs> you know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. So I'm true. Tired. He's actually so real for that. More, daddy. Mm, all right. But just this one. Chat, once. you may not like it, but he's spitting. Uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still My money. waiting on it. Uh, 
Afraid? About that. We should talk outside. <sighs> this is so fucking wholesome. Um, I love, so like, I, I love this game. Okay, first of all, um, this was my first experience. Again, I have to read This is my first experience with anything FF7 related. Um, and what really made this game just like forever stick in my mind is truly um, the fact that this game single-handedly convinced me that like these characters are actually just like extremely good and adorable and pleasant. Everyone is just delightful. They all have so much personality. They are all just so sweet. Um, and they have great like banter. They have great dynamics. They have, and, and it's like, you know, I, at my most unfamiliar, I always just kind of pictured FF7 as like this, you know, oh, FF7, it, it, like it's a Final Fantasy. It's a brooding RPG, Square Enix. Like that's not the kind of game I like. It's, 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 it's obviously, it's obviously going to be just like super complicated and self-serious and like, you know, it's for a very specific audience and I'm not that audience, but I played this and genuinely the way it dawned on me, I was like, no, this game is adorable. No, like, no, these these characters are cute as shit. And they're, like, funny. And they, like, have delightful conversations. And I love the idea of, like, I don't know. The, I mean, the, this is why I like sharing things on the channel, because it's, like, I'm seeing people in chat who have, like, never played this game before and who are, like, this is so cute. Like, what is this? Like, I... And I and I love that because that was the same way. Daddy, um, did the people who died all return to the planet? It's of good. Course. It's just a good ass game. Let that be a lesson to you. When you want to talk to a little kid, don't go give another professional killer eyes. He continues to to just spit facts. Don't talk to her about COVID shots. <laughs> uh, use the jukebox to play your favorite tunes. You can add more songs to the jukebox by collecting music discs, which can be found in the field where their presence is marked with a music icon. Tiva's theme obtained. The shoes, oh my God. Play it. I love Tiva theme. It makes me so emotional. Anyway. Before we get on to money, I there's an empty monkey. apartment in place <laughs> just down the road. It's my eyes, fancy, they do not work. I was before we, could before we go to the now. monkey. The landlady First I must explain to you, what so is you the monkey? You wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. Turn the corner, How but do not look it, it in the eyes. The it was chaotic. Sorry for dragging you into all this. Yes. It was wrong it was of me crazy. to put you in danger like that. I, that I promise news. I won't Don't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. <laughs> I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shimmer. <laughs> How'd that go? Mm -hmm. Item shop. <laughs> so, but you make nice with everything? I thought that's a cloud. As I could, all things wait. <laughs> wait, from that angle? The oh my god! From that angle, the the S E in cursive looks like a U, so I straight up thought that said cloud. Yeah, See that? That's so funny. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. We are we are closed. My new apartment. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. They'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells Didn't them to. So, seven? The it wasn't that bad? On it was. <laughs> oh, right. Jesus, Cloud. <laughs> the worst conversationalist. And here we are. Good old Stargazer This side heads. of Midgar. You're on the second floor. Whoa, weird. 
Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with Seventh Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. 202. Yes? Oh, I mean, I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No, it's fine. As long and as you didn't tell her about my shellfish allergy. That one's, uh, know what? Very sensitive it's getting about late. that. I'll introduce you tomorrow. Wait a minute. That's Tifa's room. Don't be weird. <laughs> so I've never done that before. But I, I heard about that in a YouTube comment. So I, I had to try it on stream. That is so funny. Don't be weird. <laughs> the pause was so good. I wasn't expecting the pause. <laughs> oh. It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. Rawr. <laughs> a little bear. Is there a fucking bear in my room? Want anything else? We can always there get it. There is one thing. <laughs> my money. You guys owe me two thousand, remember? I do, and we'd love to settle up, especially since this was Where's your first my bed? job for us. But. I love seeing That's Mar it. pop back in with Sorry. the hi, Diva. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That re here you go, Mar, just for you. Wait, is it? But not for long. I'm Wait. collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> and you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help. That is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. Oh, sweet. You're the best. Sorry, hold on. I'll I see you bright and early at the bar then. Thanks again for everything. Here you go, Mar. One for the road. Sophie Rain, hi. hi. Hello, Sophie. Hi, everybody. Sleep tight. <laughs> Welcome in. We're playing Final Fantasy VII Remake, first episode. Feel free to join on in. We're having a fantastic time. <sighs> Mar, you want to see my, uh, you want to see my gallery? Is everyone so hot? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Look at this. Look at this. gallery <laughs> and counting guess it's time what for introductions it? we're gonna meet the little bear <laughs> oh shit sounds like it sounds like a big bear uh oh Hey, this is probably okay someone there? normal. Oh. Coming in. Uh oh. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> it's the door frame. <laughs> Oh no, oh no, oh no. Cloud, stop! Get back inside! Get off me! Oh. Reunion. Oh my god! <laughs> what the hell? That's what not Sephiroth. This is his apartment. 
He's got a few problems, but he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. 49. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. <laughs> this guy are sick. I think the third part's gonna be called Reunion. I would say that's a good guess if they hadn't already used that for the Crisis Core remaster. I don't think they're gonna call it Reunion. Um, I don't know. I, I, I really have no guesses overall. Can't fucking see anything. Let's go. Ah, oh, the cold light of day. This view made me tear up when I saw it for the first time. Yeah, um, I watched the uh, the Maximilian dude clip of this where he like accidentally times it perfectly with this upcoming point in the music. Uh, actually, I don't know if it's I don't know how close it is coming up, but um, yeah, it's so cool. I've been I've been watching I've been going back and watching a lot of well, his FF7 no. stuff you must be ever clown. since playing the OG. I'm Marl, your landlady. Hi, so Marl. How do you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through. Um, with all a landlady kinds of asking me if I'm high? If you no thanks. Need bend, I'll I believe the fifth. Can be about anything, even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. Yeah! Okay, um, one sec. Aubergine really wants out of my room. Hold on. Hi, buddy. Okay. <clears throat> I don't know. Uh, I don't know how much longer I'm going to be going. Like I said, this this is going to be a pretty short one. Um, just kind of the introductory stream to really get this this ball rolling. This would be a good stopping point. Um, if I didn't want to play more, <laughs> I don't know. I, okay, I actually, I really wanted to get further than this, um, but I actually might stop here, uh, because I really need to get some rest, and, uh, I need to eat food. I have not had, I've not had food since, like, uh, 3 p.m., so, uh, um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take care. I, I really want to go longer, but I, I, I think just for my, for my health, I should, I should stop here. Um... Because it's been a long day. All that stuff. I got to catch up on a lot of sleep after the last few days. So, yeah. Um, I will be back with this as soon as possible. Like I said, I am most likely going to stream tomorrow. Again, remember, tomorrow, the launch of the new Snapcube Discord server. Not subscriber only. It is public. Um, it is, by the way, I totally forgot to mention this in the prelude. I kind of irresponsible of me to forget this um i mean it's it's listed on the rules it is 18 plus only that is the um there there is an age restriction so uh do keep that in mind but it is public otherwise so tomorrow that launches i am planning to do a very short kind of like launch stream to give people an, ex an excuse to kind of gather and then send the link out send people over and then after that i am most likely going to try to fit in a little movie night to kind of like break it in have a fun little event make it something kind of community focused um rather than just letting people pile in and then saying okay have fun um i want to like do something on the launch so 
Um, I'll try to put together something kind of small, but hopefully still pretty fun, uh, even if it is literally just watching a movie. So um, that is happening tomorrow. Um, if plans change, on the off chance that plans change, I will keep you posted on Twitter and all that stuff. Um, but uh, yeah, otherwise, I'll see you soon. As I'll, I'll, I, I don't know if the stream tomorrow is going to be more FF7, but if if not more FF7 tomorrow, I will follow up with this, like, hopefully before the weekend is up. I really want to play more of this. I was hoping to go longer tonight. We got a lot to get through, but, um, you know, we'll see. Either way, VOD heads, I'll let you go here. Uh, I guess tune in for the, for the next episode, whenever that may be. Um, and I'll see you soon. Take care. <laughs>